Hey guys, so continuing with code monk sorting, we'll solve sorting problem 2, monk and suffix sort. This problem states that monk loves to play games. On his birthday, his friend gifted him a string S, a very strange choice of gift. So monk and his friend started playing a new game called the suffix game. In suffix game, monk's friend will ask him lexicographically kth smallest suffix of the string S. So the problem basically states that we're given a string s and an integer k, and we have to find the kth small suffix in lexicographical ordering of the string s. Now, to understand the problem better, let's take a look at the sample input output. This is the string s and k is 3. When we generate the suffices of the string, they'll be b, then cb, acb, and aacb basically four suffices. On sorting them, we, we obtain this ordering and the smir third smallest suffix will be b, and it's printed here. So this, the problem, can simply be broken down into three steps algorithmically. And in the second step, we have to sort the array in the lexicographical order. And in the third step, we have to return the kth element or the kth smallest element. Simple enough. Let's start coding. The header file, bits slash stdc plus plus dot h, using namespace std, we declare the string. We take the string and k as input. We also declare a vector, which stores elements of type string under the variable name arr. This vector will be used to store the suffices of the string. String current underscore suffix is initialized to an empty string because this will store suffices as we move along in the array. We start from the end and we move towards the beginning, storing a new suffix in each and every step. So the current suffix is equal to s of i, which is a current character plus the suffix which was prepared beforehand. And then we push these at the back of the array or a vector. In the next step, we sort them from array.begin to array.end. These are pointers which point from the beginning of the vector to the end. We sort them. The default ordering is the lexicographical ordering of the sort function. And in the end, we return the kth smallest element, which in this case is the array because arrays in C++ are zero indexed. Now, the code is straightforward. First of all, let's compile and test to see if they work fine on the sample input and output. Okay, cool. It's returning the correct output. Now let's submit it. Yes, all accepted.